Hello and welcome to a new episode of Success Stories. Success Stories is that show where we talk to students of Excel Academy. They will share tips for you to pass your CS exam. Joining me today is Bhavana Shree. Welcome and congratulations on passing the exam. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. So, Bhavana Shree. you have cleared in your second attempt so my first question is how did you feel after getting first attempt result what was going through your mind sir i felt that um, somewhere like the revision that i did was very less than i felt that so i thought that i should take corrective actions from now on and to be more consistent in uh, studies whereas in first attempt i feel it was all the subjects and the topics were new so that is the reason why i felt it was little bit uh, uh, with pressure whereas for the second attempt i feel that it's okay it's, it's just new to me it's okay not to feel bad about that to take it as a stepping so, stone for the next attempt so that is the reason uh, uh, where i started you know consistently uh, working uh, started working on my studies and then uh, i used to depend on the mood before now it's not like that i started uh, learning that disciplinedly we have to you know stick to the st- study time table not to procrastinate that is what i learned and referring to too many materials is what i did the mistake in the first attempt so i thought like this time i have to stick to only the institute material and the academy's notes and make a, a small key points which would help me to refer to refer the notes and topics so the those two corrective actions is what i uh, made sir for this pattern brilliant i think what you told is a message for all our students who are watching please stop blaming others my students who are watching this i think bauna has told something very well when she failed she did not blame others she said what did can i do better and she thought the revision is not good she is not uh, studying from icsi mainly and she has made the corrective action but bauna one thing you have to sit at home alone and study how was that how difficult was that no sir it was not so difficult whereas like i used to uh, divide the study hours uh, uh, and you know like i used to study all the four subjects every day i used to keep two hours for each subject and then i used to give gap of one and a half hours so it was not so boring as well whereas at, at home my parents also they used to encourage me uh, whenever i felt like i was low or i was not motivated they used to motivate me and they used to divert me and weekly once i used to watch a movie or something like that not to you know completely uh, dive into studies i used to balance everything so it was not so boring sir whereas like full, being a full time cs student i got more time to dedicate to cs so i am happy for that very good i think being a full time cs student makes a very big difference in fact this time uh, so many people of excel academy have passed we have had the, one of the most bumper results and i'm doing the success stories with different students almost everybody gave time for studies because they're full time many people left their job and studied for cs end of the day it is really worth it so people watching it please realize that you have to give time without time you really won't get results and it is your next 30 40 years career it is worth to invest 6 months completely into studies and you will get the results now tell us in the four subjects what is the marks you got and which subject was most challenging or difficult for you sir in jgl i scored uh, 52 and then in company law i scored 42 uh, in sbc 49 and in tax laws i scored 57 so the difficult subject was company law sir the question paper was a bit tough i couldn't yes. attend the last 20 marks so that is the only subject where i've got very less marks i i hope that uh, you know the institute had prepared the question paper a little bit easier i could have written for 20 marks more and i could have you know crossed 50 marks so that is where i'm little bit not so satisfied but whereas that i'm very happy that i you know within second attempt i cleared the exam i'm happy for that okay great in your uh, daily like morning to night since you're full time student how did you divide your day uh, what were some of the techniques which you used uh sir i am an early bird i can't study at late night so morning i used to start around like 7 and then 7 to 9 and then i used to give like one and half hour gap and then again for two hours so minimum at least three subjects i used to cover in a day sir uh mornings i used to keep theory subjects because i'm good at theory subjects 
whereas in evening so that i should not feel sleepy i, should, I used to take up the practical subjects like tax law and used to work out the mcqs so that is where i i post 9 pm i used to not study sir only in the morning and afternoon and late evening i used to study sir so that is how i used to uh, divide the subjects and i used to stick to the study time table each day this subject has to be finished and this chapter has to be finished i used to morning as soon as i wake up i used to set myself like this is the uh, subject i have to finish this topic i have to finish so at the end of the day before i sleep i used to go through what and all i have covered in a day and every week i used to revise again whatever i have studied in that week i used to revise that so this is how i used to plan so okay okay great tell us about one day one answer because you are one of the most regular students to write answer in our one day one answer for people who are watching it we had a whatsapp group where student used to write one answer every day from all question paper and we used to give some feedback how they can improve and bhavna was one of the student who was very regular in that that is why i'm asking you yes sir because like uh, we as ts students we you know tend to read read keep on reading the textbook and we forget to go through the guideline answers since because audio i was there it was like directly making us to go through the question papers and getting an insight of what the expect what the institute is, is expecting us from how to write the answer so in that way it helped a lot sir so writing one day one answer was also really helpful because it would guide us like how to write the question paper what is the expectation of the institute so because writing one day one answer is like very good sir that task was like my favorite so i used to regularly write it very good and what about the other mentorship tasks at excel was there something which was uh, you implemented and you got any results uh sir the meditation and then physical exercise is what i like the most because since we are full time cs students since i am a full time cs student uh physical activity is very low while you are staying at home you will always feel lazy to do things so doing meditation and then physical exercise was like my favorite sir morning when i used to wake up since i was an early bird i used to finish my exercise and then uh, take shower and do my all uh, morning routines and then i used to sit to study sir so more focus was there sir, in the morning doing that task and then mind map tasks and then weekly tests all these things helped me a lot sir then during second attempt uh, it was very much helpful sir mm, very good very good now tell us about your experience with the teachers at excel how was that <laughs> coming to company law you only took that subject so complex company law subject was simplified because of your uh, like daily life scenario examples that you gave was very useful sir and whereas coming to jigl soumya ma'am's class was very nice and she used to teach each and every topic with uh, simple examples sbsc swati ma'am class is very was very engaging i used to like her classes especially part b intellectual property rise those classes were very nice Kaushik sir's class was also very good, uh, and the weekly test that he used to set also was very good. Uh, like more MCQs, which were like, which we used to feel like more and more uh, competitive. Like after seeing the result, that was very motivating. Even he used to cover all the topics. I liked his classes too, sir. So each each faculty was very good, sir. They used to give their hundred percent in teaching, and it was very engaging, and it was very nice, sir. And did you write the weekly tests? We used to give every week test. Did you write? And uh, how was that? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I used to write the weekly test, and the feedback that I used to get, and I'm um, seeing those marks. It motivated me more to not to skip the weekly test and take it uh, each week. So yeah, that's good. So for everyone watching it, see, for some bad luck or some reason, you may not pass in the first attempt. But if you are continuously giving effort. you will pass if not first second attempt you will definitely pass and perfect example is bhavanashree it is the constant consistent dedicated effort which we have observed as a teacher which she has given and she has got the result there is nothing too complex when you look at the company secretary results so this is what we want to tell everyone keep it simple stay consistent and next thing is now that you have passed you can give suggestions to other students what do you think are the two to three top mistakes students do and what is the solution you are suggesting after you pass sir i would like to give three suggestions one is that not to refer too many materials to stick to mm -hmm. simple institute 
a textbook and then make key points of your own so those two things are like very important not to refer to uh, too many materials and not to get distracted uh, through social media platforms not to go through that and spend time and also not to procrastinate and depending on the mode that is not what we have to do we have to be you know disciplinedly every day we can't get motivated so discipline is what wins and lots of 100% of hard work and 60% of smart work is required to pass cs so these three things are like very important so great the great great so if somebody is looking for cs coaching online coaching students say it doesn't work but you took online coaching so how do you see the effectiveness sir i feel like self study you know it will be very difficult to understand the terms if we join coaching it is very much helpful sir so the big complex topics whatever it is there if we join a uh, online coaching the complex topic will be reduced into key points uh, the the way of approaching the topic will become easier comparatively so coaching online coaching is better sir and moreover uh, online coaching is more good sir like uh, since we have recorded classes each and everything it is feasible as a as a student point of view it is very feasible sir at any time we can refer to it so it is not at all a problem so online coaching saves lots of time more feasibility that is good sir comparatively online coaching is better sir great and finally if you have to recommend excel what would be your two three reasons for other students to recommend sir i feel excel academy provides the best coaching compared to other coaching centers and then now uh, we have weekly tests and mentorship task mainly the men- mentorship task and mentorship call given by shrimati ma'am all these things help these tiny changes that excel academy provides the these things task help us most sir. so i feel that excel academy is best for the cs students sir. yes again you, it's not because i'm here you can whatever honestly you feel you can tell thanks a lot no sir time. i feel that i really feel that excel is the best sir because like when i have i have seen my cousins also like even they used to they when they they did now they are in article ship they used to go for other coaching sir uh, uh, classes they used to say that the faculties uh, did not uh, clarify the doubts much and uh, even they used to provide tests but it was not weekly tests just monthly ones and just to not uh, correct it on time they also not give the feedback whereas in excel there is nothing as such like uh, if the weekly test happens on sunday then within wednesday or thursday we'll get the feedback so as uh, within that time we can analyze what mistakes we have done the corrective actions and mentorship task which is not provided in any other academy so i feel that mentorship task the mentorship call the daily task that is provided especially odoa that is the best sir. no coaching will say that you have to go through the guideline answers do write it every day so i feel that that part helps a lot sir thanks thanks a lot for everyone who is watching it uh, please realize that our goal is to make you pass simple and we do everything to ensure that you do and please realize one thing without the hard work of students results will not come it is students like bhavanashree who has given the hard work and we can see that and like i said you may get the result late but you will definitely get if not first second attempt you will clear give your hard work and for support like us somebody will support you but without hard work without discipline results will not be there because maximum students don't have that hard work don't have discipline even if you join us you will not pass if you don't have hard work and discipline that is what i want to clearly tell all our students so with that thanks a lot uh, bhavana for sharing all your thoughts and we wish you the very best for the next module and we'll see you again in success story once you pass the second <laughs> module thank you sir thank you yes so i look forward okay. to see you again in success stories all the best to you and for everyone watching it we will see you in the next episode of success story like bhavana said please stay consistent don't procrastinate and stick to icsa material thank you <laughs>